You know, before the year 1846, every single surgery that was done was done while the patient was completely wide awake. Because of that, surgeons back then were never really graded based off of how good they were at actual surgery. Rather, they were pretty much just graded on how fast they were, because the faster the surgery, the less pain the patient would feel. But as you might know from personal experience, fast doesn't always mean good. During the 1800s, one of the fastest the most famous surgeons was a man named Robert Liston. His specialty was amputations, and the way that he saw it, he was basically just speed running a game. Every time he did an amputation, he would always ask someone to time him so he could see if he beat his personal record. But one day, as he was speedrunning his surgery, he just went a bit too fast and accidentally cut off his assistant's finger. When he realized what he'd done, Robert jumped back in shock, but as he did so, his saw accidentally grazed the coat of an older doctor who was watching nearby. Thinking he'd been stabbed, the old doctor died of a heart attack, while the younger assistant and the patient died from infections from their wounds. He literally killed three people with just one surgery. 